a white person, tired of political correctness, questioning when immigration will stop, tired of anti-white propaganda. It's only racist when white people do it. These messages were plastered across Edmonton for the world to see. These messages were what passed for public discourse. Mr. Speaker, a former MP and current PC leadership candidate stated, our national railway would not have been built if we had been governed by social license rather than rule of law. Sure. These sure. are racist statements. I have a fairly thick skin, Mr. Speaker, but one of the messages that I received on social media stung a bit more than the rest. It read loosely, grow a bleeping brain and some ethics, you dumb chink. Shameful. When we hear politicians talk about screening people for barbaric cultural practices and screening for anti-Canadian values, we all suffer. When we let ourselves forget that this hate and vitriol affects real people, we all suffer. We cannot sit idly by and comfort ourselves by saying that this is nothing more than a fringe minority. We cannot sit idly by and believe that we have nothing to be worried about. Because we should be worried, Mr. Speaker. We should be worried and know that this type of politics is not just coming to Alberta and Canada, that this kind of politics is already here. Mr. Speaker, for all honourable members in this House, for every single Albertan who believes in equality, speak out, make noise, and make a difference. This can't wait. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.